guys, how are you going? Quick little uh, video, little bit of an installation on a trip uh, making up north to the border again at Sirat. Um, I just thought I'd give you a little bit of a view here along what is a new part of the Autostrada. I actually just got off it, just finished. So this is around, um, uh, we're up north now near Bakal and heading towards Sujava. So I've got Ed, Ed with me from Georgia, he's sitting next to me, uh, taking him for a bit of a drive, have a look around. We were planning to go into Ukraine today, um, but the fuel situation there is not good, so there's every likelihood we could get stuck in there and not enough fuel to get back or get there. So the plan is just to go up to the border, take buy a bit of stuff, take a bit more stuff up there, have a night. And then, uh, yeah, we're just going to drive around, show it a bit of the rest of the country tomorrow. Um, but for now, just as I turn the camera on to show you guys a bit of the new Autostrada, it ran out. I'm sure it was longer than that. Okay, but one of the good things though, we should be free of this one and a half lane soon. I've showed this in other videos, it's not a, I'm not a big fan of it. I just think it's pretty dangerous, causes accidents and uh, yeah, a lot of deaths along this road. But we've got about another 15 kilometers of it and then it'll be back to just a single lane. So beautiful day, sun's out, nice and green out here. And yeah, probably about 100 and 174 k's to go to the water. But yeah, nice little stretch along here with, um, I think these are oaks, oaks or some plant buff out there can correct us because I have no idea, I'm not a tree person. Ed, you got any idea what these trees are? Not at all. I'm, <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a seaman, not a, a landman. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If there were a heap of fish along here, you'd probably tell us what fish they are, but uh, yeah. All right, so yeah, some people have asked where the videos have been <coughs> and why no videos. It's just been a bit busy and uh, focusing on work and also on Ukraine. And so yeah, it's just one of those periods. I was hoping to get in there and make some really good content, but look, that'll come in a few weeks. So just a couple of driving videos and um, see what we come up with the uh, rest of today and tomorrow. All right, pick up again later.
nowhere to be seen in the rear view mirror because I'm always checking to see who's coming up. Yeah. Oh, it could be a Ford actually. at all mate when you're sitting in the passenger seat. <laughs> yeah. not, not because I sit here but because I only have short sleep last night. Yeah. Mate I, I can drive for 10 hours or whatever no problem at all. Put me in that seat for two hours. I don't <laughs> Yeah, exactly. It keeps you awake, so... Just waiting for the day where... The day will come 50 years from now where you'll just... No key or anything, it'll just sense who you are. Which they already they already have that technology now. You turn the destination and that's it. That's it.
opportunity to spend another 50 years on this earth in a new body and keep enjoying life and keep traveling and doing stuff. I love my life as it is now. Don't need any changes. Except lower checks. <laughs> <laughs> To be honest, I'm very satisfied. said sense of community, you know, like everybody here will know each other. Yeah. Everybody's relative. 